Hello, this is Apostle Patrick T. Randolph coming to you live from Praise Christian Center World Outreach, wanting you to know that I care for you. That's why we take the time to put together this broadcast to let you know that we do care for you. But the most important thing is, is God cares for you. I'm coming to you from Praise Christian Center World Outreach on Houston's east side, 1100 Dell Dell, hallelujah, in Channel View, Texas. Channel View is simply another little uh, part of, of Harris County that's not incorporated. Amen. And so uh, I want you to know that God loves you and we have a free policy that you can come into the church, hallelujah, and you can be fed the word of God and you can be blessed by the worship and the songs and so forth that we present to our God each and every time we come together. Worship and praise is so important. But right now, uh, I want to just continue to share with you, I told you that uh, your giving proves your love unto God. God proved his love towards us. The scripture says it very clearly. God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son. So love and giving, love and giving go hand in hand. Praise the name of the Lord. And so God proved himself, proved how much he loved us by giving us an opportunity for salvation through the giving of his son. There are so many other people out in the world, hallelujah, that are lost. There are so many people that don't have any idea about God, no relationship with God at all. And your giving, hallelujah, helps to bring that to pass in their lives because it, it finances and helps the church to pull out the gospel and do the things that the church needs to do. But when it comes to proving your love, the scripture says this, and I want to read this to you from 2 Corinthians chapter 8. It says, uh, in verse 24, it says, Wherefore, show ye them and before the churches the proof of your love and of your boasting, on, of our boasting on your behalf. In other words, Macedonia, this, this scripture is talking about the church of Macedonia. This church was a poor church. Wow. But out of their generosity, the scripture declares, out of their generosity and their love, they gave more. They gave way and above their own ability to give. That's an awesome statement to make. That says that they really must have their hearts in the gospel. They must have their hearts in God. Hallelujah. Isn't that awesome? But the scripture even says they gave them first, they, they first of all gave themselves to God and then unto us, the apostle said. That's an awesome statement. That's an awesome thing to think about someone. First of all, they gave themselves to God. And then after that, they gave themselves to apostles. And then they received offerings. They received offerings uh, from the people for the work of the gospel. That's amazing. That's truly amazing. But the scripture says it's the, it, it actually is the proof of your love. You prove your love through your giving. Jesus said this. He said, where, for, for where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. Hallelujah. So what do you treasure? What do you treasure? Whatever you treasure, that's where your heart's going to be as well. And so the glorious gospel has to get out. And if you love the gospel, your treasure will be in the gospel, getting the good news out of the salvation that's available to you and everybody else through the love of Christ. I care.